It gets later and later every time. Hello folks, this is Vagrant World back with another day in Animal Crossing New Horizons. Day 9, technically, I guess. Day 8 or 9, something like that. And um, as you can see, behind Mr. Tom Nook, we have our brand new Resident Services building. Hooray! Oh. Oh. Is it Mabel? Oh, it's Isabel, Isabella, Isabel. Now I don't play past Animal Crossing games, so I don't actually know what Isabel's role is or what she does. But I know she's very popular. Oh, she's cute. They're rocking these Hawaiian shirts. Oh, what's going on? The plaza some much needed improvements as well. It's for residents visiting peddlers who take advantage of its prime location. But now there'll be seasonal events, yes, such as coming up in this April. That was nearly enough English. Oh no, Tom! Ah, That makes me kind of sad. I guess that makes sense. Tom's like running his business, you know, getting his capitalism on. And at the moment, like at the start, he doesn't really have any employees, so he does everything himself. But eventually, the whole point of running a successful business is really to bring in people who know what they're doing and are better at specialised tasks than you are. We're growing, growing, growing. Alright. Here we go then. Big things have changed on the island. Let's uh, have a little peek around. <sighs> How's everyone doing? Good? Good. <laughs> <clears throat> Come on, Tom, buddy. I want to get going. Oh, we have mail. Right. Do I have anything in my inventory? Uh, no, inventory looks perfectly okay. Did I redecorate the house? I think I've redecorated slightly. Let's go inside. Did I redecorate the house? No. Oh, yeah. <laughs> if I was running around a field of turnips or something, that's the music I'd want on. I did buy another... I went and farmed like another 60,000 last night and then spent it all on turnips. So I've got about 140, 150,000 worth of turnips. Nook Inc. Ooh, to celebrate the opening of the new building, we have lots of new Miles Redemption items available. We now have a new service for Nook Miles Plus members to earn five times more miles. Okay, let's have a little look. Very exciting. Oh, sweet, I got a free Nook Miles ticket. Okay, cool. I think the music's changed as well. I need to sneeze so badly. Ooh, right, well, let's check our Nook Miles for the day. Is it? Oh, yeah, sweet. So, I guess once a day we get a times five daily quest as well. Now, I don't have any fossils, but we should be able to get some. Sell an item for a fortune, a uh, hot item. We can do that. We can do that. We can do that. These are all nice and easy ones. We should talk to everyone. This is Fawn. She is adorable. Fauna. Fawn would be. <laughs> makes me think of the fawn from Pan's Labyrinth, which I guess is a very different direction to go in. Ah, Glad you're liking it, babe. Glad you're liking it. Right, let's go check out this new... Look at this. Very cool. We're going to have to move this. This is unbecoming. Eh. At least it's in the centre now. Right, let's go check out the new resident services building. What new options do we have available to us? How are you going to steal... Ah. Oh. Oh, it's cute! <laughs> okay. Oh. Okay. Homes of construction. General Island Mountains Resident Support. When you have a moment, please set my account. Okay, okay, Tom, Tom, Tom. I'll sit down. I'm gonna check the box. Because there's tons of cardboard boxes. And a freezer! I'm gonna take that. 
I don't think I care about the rest. They can all stay in there. But I want a freezer. Uh, I tell you what, we'll sit down first. So let's go talk to Tommy Boy first. Oh, look at this little balloon. Do I have to put it on the side? Yeah. Yes, yes, this is the construction consultation counter. What is our next project going to be? We don't have anything being built right now. Okay. Fun little projects. I like fun little projects. Yes, inclines and moving existing buildings is on my list as well. I just want a little bit more room behind my house, but I also want to build another bridge. Of course, Tom. <laughs> So a desert island, Boston community. I want to do something big to celebrate. I'm sure you do, Tommy boy. I'm sure you do. <laughs> KK Slider, that's the dog, right? I think. It's gonna come put a show up. We're gonna have a concert. Biggest fan, buddy. I do have excellent taste in music, must be said. <laughs> I don't know, I want tons of strangers wandering around my island. I like my little deserted island life, you know? Alright. Oh, what should I do, buddy? Project K. This plan of mine providing three main stages. First, we need more visitors to come to our island. We need more folks to move here. And now we need to increase the overall image. Okay, sounds like a plan, Tom. We need a campsite. Okay, oh, you're going to make me build a campsite or like 10 trillion things that go towards a campsite? No, oh, my little legs. Okay. Well, it's nice we've got a goal again. Yeah, we've got something to, to build towards. Let's talk infrastructure. Our bridge. Okay, cool. How, just tell me how much this bridge is, alright? Okay. Well, I want a bridge first. Let's build a bridge. Ah. Right. They are expensive. I was not expecting prices in this kind of region. Which one would I go for? I really like the Zen Bridge. Actually. The Zen Bridge is actually the nicest one, but um, I don't know if we're going to get away with that. Maybe the brick one. The brick one's pretty cool. I can't afford it, buddy. No, I'm just going to... We're going to think about that. Ugh. Okay, so I need to go do the camp kit by my home. I need to pay that off. I want to expand, Tom. I know I haven't paid you off. Uh, okay, fine. That's fair enough, Tom. That's fair enough. Okay, right, 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 right. So we can expand our home. Well, when we paid off the loan, we can relocate a little bit. I still can't fully terraform. I'd like to be, you know, pick like a nice big empty spot for my house and I can properly decorate around it and stuff like that, but we're not there yet. Uh, let's talk to Isabel. Stop. Sit down, child. There we go. Bloody Nora. She looks terrified. I'm good. No worries, Isabel. Oh. 
I think this is for like getting people to move out and stuff like that if you want to change the residence. But I love our town. Our town is filled with lovely people, so not worried about that. Let's check in on the finally I can check in on the next stop. Where all my money is. Oh nice. Very cool. Oh, very cool. <coughs> That's actually perfect because. I screwed up and I missed my Nook Miles Redemption, like, you know, with the daily check-in, I missed it. So now they've boosted me back up to seven plus days. It's not, I actually did go online as well. It's not like I didn't go online that day, it's just that uh, I just forgot to check in with the ABD, basically. Alright, let's have a look at redeeming on Nook Miles. Do we have uh, some new stuff? So we've got, ooh, a bell voucher. Ah, so this is, if I remember correctly, you can trade in your miles for bells. So it's 6,000, it's really not much though. Customizable phone case kit, ultimate pocket stuffing. <gasps> I need it. I have to get it, I have to get it. Is this all new stuff? I don't reckon it. Look at that, I love that. And that. There's a lot of cool stuff, and that, and that. I want all this stuff, I actually want so much of this. Oh my God, oh my God, it's a robot. So much new stuff! Oh my god! I didn't expect all this. Wow, we can probably decorate the town now, can't we? We can full on decorate the town. <gasps> I must have it! Oh, it's so expensive though. I knew there'd be new stuff to take all my money away from me. <laughs> I really think the, um, the inventory expansion is the top priority though, so... Let's grab that. 8,000 miles is a lot, but... I can't turn that down, can I? Yee. <laughs> I don't. I don't know what he's figuring out, you know. But look, that is beautiful. That is that is literally erotic. I don't know how else to put it. And let's have a look at the shopping. See what they were saying. Well, obviously, we're gonna have to get some miles because I don't have any, but. Oh, very nice. He sneezed again. What's going on with me? Ah. Ooh, excuse me. Bloody Nora. Okay, let's grab that. I just grabbed all the music. That looks quite nice, actually. I'm not down for that one. Okay. I think I'm done. Oh, wait, no. We should get some money out. I've got 100k in the bank. I'm getting nowhere near paying off this loan. I did spend 150k on um, bell uh, turnips, admittedly, so that probably slowed me down slightly, but still. <clears throat> right. Oh, I've got a cold. Sorry, there's going to be some sniffing and coughing and dying. I've definitely got a cold. But I'm sure it's just a cold. Because <laughs> it's been going on for a while, but it's just got a little bit worse. Oh, that's all I got. Did I not get anything for expanding my inventory? Oh, wow, okay. Um, okay, so what's the one that we need to do? It's the, the heart item, so we'll go find out what that is. And the rest we can work on. <clears throat> do I have a net? Yeah, I seem to have everything I need. I'm just going to go put the... I was going to put the fridge back, but tell you what, let's go talk to the boys first. Oh, I changed... We need to get rid of this. This isn't ready yet, is it? No. <clears throat> oh, oh, I see you. I see you, you cheeky little fossil. Wait, did I not get it? Is, is it? Oh, there it is. Ah! You want to womp on a tree for a little bit? Hooray! Let's go, we need a few of those. I'm sure we'll find the rest as we wander around. Just gonna pick this up. Um... The girlfriend's left now, we're officially you know, full-on into isolation, so she, she's actually got her own Switch coming in on the way, so we she, she will actually be... Oh, you're, you're expensive. Let's grab you. So she won't actually be playing anymore on this character. Um, I think we're going to keep the house because it's a nice looking house. And what I'll do eventually is just kind of connect it all together and build ourselves a nice little nice little town. See the idea? Right, let's check in with the boys. What is the hot item of the day? Simple DIY workbench. Well, we can definitely do that, so that's cool. Bam, bam, bam. What do we need for a DIY workbench? I actually want to craft a couple of those because it's like a nice inversion. <gasps> Laser magic trick! 
Boys have been here so many times. What's that on the right, though? What's that? A metal is just a metal can. Okay. Oh, I'm so tempted to get the cat thing as well. I don't have a cat, though. I don't think it suits my... I, it doesn't suit my apartment. We're going to call it an apartment now because we're fancy. But... I might want it for the future, right? And it, maybe it wouldn't pop up in time, so we miss a crap it. The magic set I'm actually less convinced by. Let's talk, kids. I need to sell a couple of things. I'm really just offering a butterfly. It's just purchase a butterfly from me. That's all I'm looking for here. Like 2,000, though. 2,500, that's really good. They're really easy to catch as well, as long as you've got like some... <clears throat> for us it was the hybrid tulips. Oh, right, yeah. So this is the big thing. This is the first time checking the turnip prices. So I bought at about 95 bells per turnip. Okay, we're not selling today. <laughs> I tell you that much, we're not selling today. It changes every day at midday. Let's have a look at the, uh, the cabinet. Any new stuff? Yep, we've got a new umbrella. We get all the umbrellas. Working on my umbrella collection. Uh, nothing new. Doesn't look like it. DIY for beginners. Wild Dreams DIY. We've got all them. Yep, that's all old, but anything cool here? Great shanty wall. That could be useful, I think. I'm really not as big a fan as the others. The wall of Beth, uh, tepid. I like, my, I, like my, I like my walls have a little bit of pop, you know? Okay, so we're not selling the turnips. I'd like to sell turnips because I just have thousands of turnips. Eventually, I'd like a room dedicated to turnips. Maybe what I can do is use the girlfriend's house and she'll never be using it and I'll turn it into a turnip storage facility. Actually, you can't leave stuff in other people's houses, can you? My master plan has been foiled. Doo-doo. Doo-doo. Do, 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 do. So what we're going to do is we're going to craft a simple DIY workbench. It's funny, you leave your stuff outside and I can steal it. It's like it's mine now, you know. <laughs> It actually makes me so happy. I just... <clears throat> oh! Oh, I completely forgot. Okay, well, first of all, that's very cool. We can actually probably craft that already so we can get that done. Um, I got a coelacanth. I actually completely forgot to mention. It's outside. I haven't donated it to the museum yet. We'll go do that in a minute. I caught a coelacanth last night. Ah, I'll show you. It's in the correct video. I haven't clicked it yet. Finally got one. I've got all the March fish, all everything that's leaving in March, so I'm ready for April. There it is. See, like, you can get all the time, but it has to be raining. I'll show you what I did to catch it if you want, but, you know, I'm sure lots of people have got one. I, I think it is, like, the rarest fish, based on its position, anyway. These are all quite rare. Eh, football fish isn't that rare, actually. The ore fish is, though. I did catch a second ore fish as well. Are we doing all right? There's definitely more fish we can catch right now. As in, I've not caught every possible fish. I haven't caught any of the pier fish, for example. But I've caught everything I had to catch in March. There's a couple of fish we need to catch in April. We're going to do a fishing episode. I need to catch a blue marlin and a... The girlfriend caught one. What was it? Oh, tuna. A tuna. I need a tuna. Okay, let's see if we can do this and the um, the other thing I wanted to do, which was a simple DIY workbench. That's a mini. Simple. Oh, we just need five hardwood. Okay, so we need five hardwood... We need 20 hardwood, 15 softwood, 15 wood, and 69 nuggets. Do, 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 do. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> we are very good. I really wish you could choose how much you want to take off a material, but that, that upsets me greatly. It seems like such a weird thing to not include, you know? Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. What I want to do is buy, like, 10 more... <laughs> Hi-Fi players and place them around the town, playing that music constantly, so I never have to go without it. Right, we should be able to craft both things. There we go, very cool. Campsite construction kit. 
and we're gonna make a simple DIY work. We, we can make a few of these. Nope, I'd like that one more, but how can I make, uh, I can make three. Let's just do it. I'll just sell them all, why not? We do need cash, at some point, like, I, at the, like my, what I'm, <laughs> speak English vagrant. I am kind of gambling on the turnips. I spent a lot of money on the turnips and I think if I find a day where they sell for like 200 plus, then, you know, we can instantly afford to pay off our loan, which is kind of what I'm looking for, right? But it would be nice to have a backup, you know? And at the moment, I don't really have one. So. Like, there is a chance. I'll check in with the turnips every day, and they'll just never sell for a decent price. And I could I could forfeit <laughs> hundreds of thousands of bells. Purchase my workbenches from me, my friends. Tell you what, that's not bad. That might be worth doing. I've got a, uh, people say, oh, don't do the iron nuggets and stuff, but I've got a lot of iron nuggets, so we can turn them into a bit of cash. Um, hardwood is pretty easy to find. You can actually make an axe. It's cool. There's actually two types of axe in the game. There's the metal one, and then there's another one. There's three, actually. There's flimsy. There's four, actually, if you include the golden one, but you can um, turn your flimsy axe into two other axes, either the metal one that will cut down trees, or the other one which you can use to hit a tree three times and get all the wood, but it doesn't cut it down. So maybe we make one of those and we go uh, wood farming. And we just make tons of those things. There we go, a thousand miles for that. Which is necessary, because everything's super bloody expensive all of a sudden. You catch some bugs and get some fossils assessed. We'll work on both of those as well. Right, what are we doing with our lives? Well, let's go put down this campsite construction kit. I think, we, I think what we're gonna do, Oh, I need to change my... Nope, no, 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 no. How do I do this again? Map. Where's the map? I turned off the uh, permanent mini-map because I need to take some screenshots. I like having the mini-map on. I think it's more helpful. So I think I'm going to move over here. The plan is for the north side of the map to be like an orchard. And eventually that's probably where I'm going to move my house. But over here, we don't really have any plans. Well, I guess I don't have any plans now. It's just me on my lonesome. Um, so I think the campsite... And it's a nice place for a campsite. So I think we're going to put it over here. Do, do, do. Oh, okay. I always click that one by accident. I'm sure it's going to look lovely. Yeah, it looks beautiful. This is where I want to build a bridge to. This would be the area I had in mind for a bridge. Now, the other idea for this area was to plant lots of flowers and use it as like a bug harvesting area. And also, you know, harvest the flowers and get some mutant flowers and stuff like that. But that's something we can still do. Lots to do, folks. Busy, busy day in Animal Crossing. Right, we need to go back and talk to Tom. I always want to call him Tommy Boy, but then his kid's called Tommy. It's very confusing. Life is hard. Right, what is next? Hello, hello. I did. After, you know, I built the thing myself. Oh. This is, this is how you're going to delay me, isn't it, Tom? This is the next step that I have to wait every day now, basically. Will you just sit down? Oh my god, I think you don't hit A. I think that's the, the problem. Oh, wait, no. I think he's going to make me wait. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to have to come back tomorrow. Which is fine. The game does want to... It likes to time get you a little bit. It bothers some people. Me, it kind of makes sense. I don't want to spend all day, every day, working on projects and stuff like that. What I want to do is set them off in the morning and then, you know, go catch some fish and stuff and chill. Alright, I will do the seal account. Just give me a minute. So, ooh, cheeky. Um, do I have enough money? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's plant another tree. I'm going to do a little experiment here. There's lots of people online who say... Oh, no. I have to make a shovel as well. Is that the last shovel I had? Yeah. What pain. Lots of people who say that the max you should put in... Oh, wait. How would you even... 
Hmm. Okay, I'm going to plant 20,000. Lots of people say the max you should plant is 10, right? But there is evidence suggesting maybe we can plant a little bit more. Although, I'm not sure the game agrees with me. <laughs> Why can't I plant? What's going on? I am confused. Why can't I plant? Are you in the way? I doubt it. Okay, I'll, I'm gonna come back. But the point is, lots of people say 10k is the max, and I'd like to, I'd like to test that theory. Why are these not growing? I'm so confused. They're the same space away. Why would these ones not grow? I'm gonna have to move all my apples. What a massive pain. I, I don't want to. I don't get it. <laughs> it's just I don't get it at all. That's actually really annoying. I'm gonna figure out another way to do the orchard. Um. Hmm. Right, let's have a little wander around. Oh, I can't. I have a shovel. Okay, never mind. I'll be back for you. I need a shovel. Maybe that's why. Maybe it's my lack of shovel. That's the problem, actually. Let's go make a shovel. Do I have what I need? I think I need stone. Do, do, do. Do, do. Oh, hardwood. And then, yeah, okay. Well, I did say I want to do some crafting, so let's go get another... Let's go get some hardwood. We'll make a we'll make one of the different axes as well, and we'll try to do some of that. And that's what we'll do today. That's what we'll do today. I was gonna do a fishing episode, but we'll do the fishing episode in. <laughs> all right. What was I gonna say? I have no idea what I was gonna say. Let's grab all this. We're gonna use all of it because why not? Do 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 do. We'll do a fishing episode. I think I was going to do it tomorrow, but tomorrow's the 31st of March, right? So I think what we do instead is actually do it in the 1st of April. Because that's going to be a new month, and that means a new fish. Plus we'll have to do the pier. So on the 31st, it's in the day after tomorrow. Although I am a day ahead. I'm always one day ahead in um, Animal Crossing, so it's two days from now, but only one day for you guys anyway. Um, what? <laughs> We'll do a pier fishing video and try to get the tuna and the blue marlin because we need to get those this month anyway. A shovel. And let's make many benches because we need some moolah, folks. We need some moolah. We can make 12 of them. And we'll still have plenty of nuggets left over. I think we won't bother farming any more wood for this. But I'll just, I'll just sort of take the money I can get right now. It should be... If I'm making 12 of them, it should be what? How much did we get for the last ones? 6k? 8k? It should be about 30k bells. Not bad. Not bad. And then what are we doing? Oh, the seal account! <laughs> I'll get there as <laughs> so much dead to <laughs> Uh, it's always like this. On the, on the big new days, you know, lots of stuff has changed today. This may be one of the biggest days in terms of new things accessible to me, you know? Chill. That's the whole point, right? I will make one of those uh, axes eventually, but not right now. Let's just pop these benches off, sell these off, go put the sealer camp away. No, but we're saving the sealer camp for last. What we're gonna do is go on a little. Oh, it's a bee! Hello. We're gonna go on a little fossil hunt because there's, there's a few fossils knocking around. Hello. <laughs> There's a few fossils knocking around the island, so we'll get all those, and then when we go to the museum for the seal account, we can get the fossils assessed. That's the plan. That's what we're doing. That sounds like a good one. One more, I think. Two more. I do want to fish one fish. Just one fish. There's a reason. Oh, thanks, Fauna. Away we go. Do -do. It's weird, my headset keeps dying, and it's on full charge. And when I play Doom, it never dies. 
It literally only dies when I play Animal Crossing. It's very weird. Buy my many hot items. I'm tempted to- oh no, I'm not tempted to keep one. I'd like one by the house, but I think we'll make a nicer one for that. Is it 32k-ish? Yeah. Okay! So I've got 150k again. 150, 100, about 180k. I'm only about halfway to paying that loan off. But we do have also 150k in turnips. So, gonna look at. This is it. It's, it's an, there he is. No, you're not allowed to look at him yet. You're not allowed to look at him yet. You're not allowed to look at him yet. Alright, Hornsby. Mornings are neat, Hornsby. Mornings are neat. So, yeah, all the campsite people are gonna move over to the right. Eventually, I would like to move my house over here somewhere. But this is meant to be an orchard. Now, the orchard didn't bloody work out. Honestly, the orchard's not that big a deal money-wise anyway. I think we might scrap the idea and just... I think what I'll do is scrap the idea and maybe put my house here. Because this is a nice spot. You know, it's kind of like on its own. Um, the orchard's okay money, but... Even 25 trees, right? Is 75... Wait, can I do this now? 25 trees is 75 pieces of fruit every three days. 75 pieces of fruit is only about 37k, so you'd have to plant a lot of trees. Why can't I plant? I don't understand. Am I only allowed like a certain number of money trees? I've got like four or five of the things right now. I should be able to plant the 10k at the very least. I just, I can't. I don't know why. It's making me sad. Be gone, money thought. On we go. Let's go find some fossils. Keep an eye for some stuff along the way. It'd be nice to make some. Oh, there's one. An incline would be really helpful. It really would. Um, you have to get up to these high reaches without having to get the ladder out. But I do think the bridge is my first priority. Actually, the... the oh, hello. <laughs> the loan is my first priority, and then the bridge. And then the inclines, I think. And of course, we'll get another loan after that, but that one's going to be humongous. I just think that right-hand side, you know, where I just built the campsite earlier on, where the river kind of goes up, like, on the other side of the river and all the way down that beach, that's where I do all my ocean fishing, because... Um, it's like the longest... What is that? Ah, cool. Okay, <laughs> helpful. I guess we just go talk to all the townspeople and hopefully... Ah, oh, that's sweet. All right, there should be one more fossil somewhere on the island, I believe. <gasps> Money tree! Yeah, um, unfortunately, this one, I planted 1,000 instead of 10 by accident, so... Oops, sorry. <laughs> Tell you what, we need to catch bugs anyway, don't we, for our uh, luck miles, so... Whoop! Oops. Eh. Come here, you cheeky little. Look, I don't even want to catch you, really. I'm just going to sell you to the Nook children. What they do with you, I don't know, okay? <laughs> Why they hoard dead animals every day, I don't know. I'm, I, I, I don't know that. I wish I did. Anyways, yeah, so. Bridge over to the right, that's where I do all my sea fishing, because it's the largest... Sort of stretch of ocean we have on the island. So it'd be nice to be able to get over there easily. Anyways, look at this, look at this, look at this. So this one right here is a hybrid. Look, because that's the red one. That's the yellow one. And together, they make this sort of red and yellow one. It's really cool. I'm going to go catch that uh, stink bug on the left. Don't think they're worth much anyway, but... There we go. That's what I was... Whoopsie daisy. Do, 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 do. I think the plan eventually is to redecorate essentially the entire island, you know. But it's alright as it is now. It makes sense. I think it's all moderately logical. Look at them, little hybrids. They're really cool. Where is this last fossil spot, though? I don't see it. Oh, I'll show you what I did for the sealer camp. We've got three anyway. We needed three for the mission, so three's fine. 
So, I mean, I don't really need to, like, it's hardly <laughs> some trick or anything. Um, I literally just ran up and down the coast during the rain. If it was a small fish, as in smaller than a sea bass, you can kind of tell the coelacanth is bigger than a sea bass, but it's a little bit tight. The coelacanth has a size 6 shadow, whilst the, oh, my shooting ball, whilst the um, sea bass has a size 5 shadow. I should grab those. Um, but I just basically scared away every fish that wasn't quite the right size. So this is probably a sea bass. It could be an olive flounder. It's always a sea bass or an olive flounder. Or a red snapper, I believe, actually. But red snapper are quite a lot rarer. Now, you're, you're an iffy one. You're in an awkward position. We'll catch one fish. Why not? Or we'll, <laughs> we'll fail to catch one fish. Yikes. Anyway, just scare, like, if I was going for the coelacanth, I would, I wouldn't bother catching that fish. I might scare it away or something like that, you know. Um, only a certain number of fish can spawn, so, I mean, if you want to catch every fish you can, you can definitely do that, but if you're after a certain fish, it pro it's probably a waste of time. You should probably focus on the correct fish, essentially. Now, what's I doing? Oh yeah, let's open this. Let's open this. Should be a DIY recipe. I'm doing my kid cat who's doing some push-ups. Had a DIY idea for a, oh, a beekeeper hive. I was actually curious if we were ever gonna get this. I'm excited about that one. I want to build like a little um, apiary. Is it an apiary? Is that what it's called? I think so. Oh, that's cute. I should keep my boss nest. I keep selling them. Right, okay, so. Steal a camp. Let's go look at him. There he is. I'll pick him up. Anyway, it's just. Just, just fished and caught him, I guess. I don't know what else to say. He's a big boy. Look at him. Isn't he cool? It's exciting. Did you lose an item? Oh, there you go. That was easy. Love me, Fauna. You're adorable. Oh. Oh, well. Cool. Well, now we know. To the museum! It's like, for example, if you're trying to catch a sturgeon, right? A sturgeon is a March only. It's not March only, but it's gonna go away after March, right? So the sturgeon is important to catch this month. Whoa! I love that. Um, the best way to catch it isn't to catch all the fish, it's to scare all the little fish everywhere else in the river and then run down to the mouth of the river in order to hopefully spawn the sturgeon in. Because a certain number of fish spawn and they don't spawn on the screen. I don't know, there's guides out there for this kind of stuff, but it does make fishing a lot easier when you know the rules around it, kind of thing. Okay, they're not all new, but something's new. And the rest can get sold for money. What is it? A Diplo Skull, very cool. We also got a Megacero Torso and a Trilobite. We'll keep the Trilobite. I keep the little ones for my own room. That's it, buddy. I want to go check on the fish. I think the Trilobite is going to be really cool. Let's grab our miles first, sir. That's all the uh, dailies done. You can do these, of course, forever. You know, keep farming Nook Miles if you absolutely wanted to. Um, I tend to just do the big daily quests. What's this? Oh, sweet. We've assessed 30 fossils so far. Yeah, I tend to just get the dailies done. That's in the times two. And then, you know, you can keep an eye on the others and get them done, but it's less of a focus. And we're definitely going to be doing the times five, of course. Now, yeah, there's the sturgeon. Look at him. Isn't he humongous? So, he, sturgeon leaves at the end of this month. So does that guy over there. That's the... String fish, the, the big colourful guy at the back. These are the river. This is actually really interesting how this is done. So these are river fish right here. That's river mouth fish. And that's river cliff top fish. So this is like the stages of the river. So it's actually really cool. There's our goldfish. These are pond fish, like the koi and the carp. Still emptying that. I'm assuming when we get sharks and stuff. I know there's a grey white shark, I know there's a whale shark, I know there's a hammerhead shark. There's some really cool Sharks to get. Not for a couple of months. I think it's June or July we get access. That's the tuna. Obviously not donated by me, but donated by Beth. Isn't he cool though? He's a big boy. I think the marlin's probably going to go in there as well. So that's like 
ocean fish, but also pier fish, because the tuna, I believe, is a pier fish only. I don't know where the seal. Oh, it must be down here. Oh, it's in the deep water section. Very cool. So there's our coelacanth, our oar fish, and our uh, football fish. The oar fish is so weird. He <laughs> just. Oh, God, right. Did we have anything else super important to do today? Tell you what, let's go talk to Pashmina and then we'll end up. How's that for a plan? And then all I'm going to do is probably farm some fish and sell them off for cash. Do I even need to? Am I just going to gamble on the turnip market? Probably. Can't do the campsite. Well, it's done already. I'd like to farm more money because, you know, I'd like to maybe get a bridge bill and get an incline bill and stuff like that. I wonder how much your inclines cost. Probably less than a bridge, right? She's lovers. I'm not going to bother checking on the other two. There's not been much new. But, obviously, when April rolls around and get all these new fish and all these new insects, we can then do a nice museum update. I'm really excited about that. Pashmina. Where does Pashmina live? Nope. You in? Hmm. She's here somewhere. She's lurking around. I'm also gonna redo. Ah, hello. I did. I wonder what the reward is for this. <clears throat> what is it? <laughs> So, yeah, she's gonna give me a piece of furniture. An arcade? Oh my god, yes! My sex dungeon can have an arcade seat! Wait, why is it a sex dungeon all of a sudden? Let's have a look at it, I'm excited. Oh, that's rubbish! <laughs> I was excited about that! Like this, I think, they, honestly, I think there's like a huge pool of possible items and they just give you a random one. There we go. Alright, we got some, we got some miles. God damn it, Pashmina. <laughs> I'm always happy to increase my furniture collection, no matter what, but... Uh, grumble, grumble, grumble. This is why I needed to expand my inventory. All this stuff up to the miles ticket, including the miles ticket. Oh god, and the shovel. This is stuff that I keep in my inventory all the time. This whole row stays there. I always have lots of fishing rods because I do lots of fishing. Um, iron nuggets so we can make new tools when we're out in the field. Ladder you obviously need for now, hopefully not in the future. But you always will, because you can go to other islands and you're going to want the ladder. You're always going to need an axe, you're always going to need a vaulting pole. You're always going to need a net. You always need everything, you know? Ah, so we can sell all this. Oh, no, I'm going to keep the... Let's have a look at the trilobite. Oh, that's really cool, yeah. Yeah, we're definitely keeping that. So that's going to go in the bedroom as well. Eventually, the idea is to have, like, a little museum room. I don't know how many rooms we get, but I'm hoping, like, ten. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm going to run out of space for all my ideas. I'm going to go put the wood back as well. All right, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done. So what am I going to do? Let me have a little thing. Tomorrow, then. Tomorrow, the new campsite will be built. That'll be really cool. Um, obviously, we'll keep checking the turnip prices. Doing a yoga? She's so cute. Am I attracted to a deer? now? let's move on with the lives. I forgot to check that at the board. <laughs> oh, it's Puck's birthday today. Oh, wait, no. 28th? Book's birthday two days ago, so yeah. <laughs> oh no, April 4th. April 4th is Book's birthday. Right, okay. Yeah. Hmm. Right, so what I'm gonna do is hopefully farm some money and then rejig the orchard by getting rid of the orchard. I'm also gonna say, let's just see one last thing. How much does it cost to relocate the house? It'll be a little annoying to get over there again. Eh, it's not that bad. Wait, this is not the right building. I'd like to relocate over to where that pond is. And we'll just move the... I was just going to plant random trees around for the orchard. I'm not, I'm not that bothered about it. It's a money-making scheme. I think it's good to have a few ideas for how you're going to make cash, but... I don't think you necessarily need... All of them, you know? Come on, Tom, you slacker. It's a good little fan. It's all perfect. It's all perfect. Um, but my home. 
I'm just gonna cast. Oh, it's not so bad. Okay, I'll, I'm gonna work on that. So, I think by tomorrow's episode, the following will have happened. Let's talk. We'll have moved our house. Hopefully. We'll be checking on turnip prices. I'll have replanted the orchard. I'm gonna stretch. Ugh, bloody hell. <laughs> and hopefully... We can get enough money to pay off our loan, which means we can then get a bigger house, and also we can work on the um, on getting a bridge. And, and the campsite will be finished, so we'll be able to start whatever our next construction project is. Yeah? Cool. Right. Done. Thank you for joining me, ladies and gentlemen. Phew. It was, a, it was a busy episode, this one. I will see you lovely folks in that next episode. Thank you so much for joining me. Cheers, much love as always. Bye-bye.